Hello guys, what's good? My name is FK Sunny and I welcome you to our YouTube channel at Sunrise TV. Truly a chosen generation. If today is your first time watching or joining us, make sure you do subscribe after watching this video. Let's get straight to the video I have today. Hey man, please, obedient, sit down. We are blessed today to have one of God's generals with us. Um, so I see a banner here. We are excited to have you with us, Reverend Eastwood Anaba. We are excited. Since we since we've been a, a church, first love church. We have not had a convention before. We have not invited anybody to preach here. So Reverend Eastwood is going to be the first visitor. Amen. And he was also the first, I think, when we were at Coligono. Um, is it Coligono or the canteen? That's at the very beginning of the church. Your parents, where your parents were. You were not born. Some of you were not born. Most of you were not born. So, since we've been here, uh, since we've had this church, we've never had a visitor. And so we are really, really honored that Reverend Eastwood will come to be with us for this weekend. We, w we actually wanted him to come for all the services, but due to circumstances beyond control, he has been able to come yesterday night and then this one. So we are blessed. Amen. Reverend Eastwood is a revivalist. And um, over the years, you know, we were in school around the same period. Over the years, he has never changed what he, the type of preaching and the type of conviction that he has been preaching uh, the word of God. I remember when he launched his book, End Time Militia. End Time, it was a green book. Yes. And we had it, and it was and about the Holy Spirit. You know, and honestly, without the Holy Spirit, we are just making noise. So he's a Holy Spirit man. Um, he's a man of a man of God, a man of the Holy Spirit, a man of. Uh, when he first came to our church, you know, we were always in amazement, watching. Or at least I was. I don't know about the others. Watching huh? the manifestations of the spirit that he has been well known for. And um, it is always like a fresh, like a rainstorm with good wind blowing through the church. So I believe many churches in the U.D. grown up churches have experienced his wonderful ministry uh, that he has he has had and so recently I um, we, did, we had this idea to have what we call he gave gifts unto men amen he gave gifts unto men so Reverend Eastwood is a gift is a gift it's one of the gifts of God a gift is a person and um, if you receive a person, you are receiving a gift from God. That's how God gives gifts. He gives the gift in the form of people. And the people are the gift. That's the gift. He gave gifts to men. And the gift is the person. So I believe that he's been a great gift to the whole body of Christ. And it is an honor for us, the children, in the children's church, to also be able to invite somebody who is a father. So, um, Joshua 
be Josh and Co are for the first time hosting a great man of God here. So we are all enjoying. Reverend Isud, I used to host you, but now I'm just here to enjoy. <laughs> That's a blessing. How many are ready to enjoy and to receive? You know, you never really change until the Holy Spirit touches you. Yes, you never really change until the Holy Spirit touches you. Yes, it is the Holy Spirit and the power of God that brings great and wonderful changes. So we have enjoyed, that is why I've always enjoyed him. I just want to enjoy that aspect, the aspect of God. I love God and I know that he loves God too. He has always loved God and he has stayed in Bolgatanga, which is not so near. Huh? If some of you have not been there before. Hmm. You'll be there, huh? It's a long journey by road, even from Tamale to Bolga. It's not a small journey. And then from Tamale to Accra. I personally, I almost died on that road. I had an accident, somersaulting all over the place, almost in Tamale, and I was almost dead. So, most of the time when you invite people, you don't know what is involved. You just see the person walking there and say, oh, you are welcome. You know? It's not like that. It involves a lot. So I'm sure if you've not traveled before, you will not appreciate the wonders and the greatness of a traveling minister. But we appreciate you, Reverend Eastwood. And uh, I want the children, the children in the church to appreciate and enjoy the gift of God. When these gifts, when these gifts, when these gifts are no more in the world, you will see what is gone from the world. And all through the years, the charismatic revival and flow that we have had in the church has been through some of these gifts. Please, please take your seats. I'm not introducing him. I'm just, a, I've been asked to say something. You get it? Yes. But um, it's a great blessing uh, today and uh, yesterday the first love church in the UK I mean they were all everybody was attentive and watching the center and it was beautiful so we are really blessed and um, I want to say Reverend Eastwood you are welcome here this is a children's church so we are, are we not children here or you, you become grown up to just that is a great blessing so we are really blessed and um, now you see you haven't had a convention before since the church began you haven't had a convention so you don't know how to come to church Tuesday evening, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday you know other things Uh, these ones you don't know but I don't know if they are going to do that but we we are we are, we are moving on into new seasons and he gave gifts unto men it's a very great and blessed program I want you to respect anointing the, the man who walked here today is an anointed man very anointed heavily anointed heavily respected even respected by the president of Ghana Oh yes, and different presidents over the years walks in a very big shoe, spiritual shoe. I'm not talking about I'm not talking about shoes. Ah. Who is that? <laughs> the other back. Okay, but that is a great blessing. So, Reverend stood once again. You are very, very welcome. And uh, I'm happy to be sitting here once again, uh, being blessed. You know, sit down. I've not finished talking. 
You know, one of the things about every great man of God is that he's a good preacher. Yes. And I use Reverend Isu as an example. I always tell people, learn how to preach well. Learn how to preach. There's no great man of God who's not a good preacher. Like he's good at preaching. When he preaches, you see that you are blessed and you understand what is happening. Yeah. And as Reverend Isu is here with us, learn about the power of God. Oh, yes. I cannot lie to you. I, st- I've stud- I studied him as he was ministering. His ministry looked wonderful to me. Yes. Study and just watch. What is he doing? What is happening? What's happening here? <laughs> Greater Love Club, you are welcome. Are you here? We have grown ups. There are a few grown ups. They are just in the front here. Uh, Reverend is with a few grown ups here. So, in case you have missed grown ups. These are the only grown-ups in the church. The rest are children. 